Sometimes one autoinjector is not enough, so doctors may well prescribe a second one. If you or the patient has delivered one autoinjector and they're feeling worse or certainly no better at all, then it may be that you need to administer a second dose between 5 and 15 minutes after the first. Remember, these are single dose syringes, so you can't deliver it twice from the same unit. So use a brand new unit and inject the medicine in exactly the same way. Make sure that the paramedics know exactly what's happened, that two or two injectors have been used instead of just one. This is very important because the paramedics may well give further drugs, so they need to know what's actually in the patient's system already. Otherwise, there could be a risk of overdosing or other interactions between various chemicals. Having a second dose is not needed for everybody, so patients must consult their doctor individually. Remember, they won't prescribe something that they don't think is needed. Reasons for a second auto-injector may vary by things like body size or age, and also what's happened in the past. It may well be that in previous attacks, two drugs have been required, so two are now routinely prescribed. If you're caring for a child, then again, get advice from their parents or themselves as to whether they need to have one or two doses.